But yes, we have, in case you were wondering, we've acquired the assassin robes and a broken hidden blade. Which will be no good to us in its current state. And we also got a codex page, which they will be explained soon-ish. Um, while we're near this viewpoint, we might as well sync with this one. Uh, and then we'll go to the trial. And hopefully our family will be released. And nothing bad will happen. Alright, how do I climb this? That's a lovely... Look at those water effects. Whoa. Right. Oh, we look so good in our robes, dude. Yeah. I can still remember the like waiting for this game to come out. I was so hyped for this one because I, I did. I really liked the first game. The first game definitely has its problems. Uh, some of the the, the missions were kind of lame, and I did I didn't really like the antagonist of the first game too much. He was a little bit bland. I'll tell you. He looked cool, but there wasn't much to him. But man. I was still so hyped for this game, and I'm about to be seen again. I st I remember I was working. I was working in um, in a different team. Like when I I, I worked at the council back in twenty, uh, well, two thousand nine, and I had been sent to work with a different team than usual in like the the two weeks before this game came out. So I spent most of that time instead of like learning. <laughs> how to, um, like, focusing on working with this new team and, and learning the stuff they were teaching me, uh, I, I just, I was just thinking about Assassin's Creed 2 and just, just wanted to play it, like, right then and there. And I still remember being picked up on the Friday that this came out. I think it came out on a Friday, it must have been. It was, like, my last day working with this new team. And my mum and my grandparents came and picked me up from work that day. And, uh... And I was just like... Because I knew the game was waiting for me at home, because it had been delivered from Amazon. I was just so fucking excited to get home and play it, and my god, that weekend was so good. Oh, I played it non-stop. Anyway... That's 11 years ago, dude. 11 years ago! Fuck, man. Anyway. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, maybe I've been saved by the, uh, by the cutscene. I think I have. Attend the acquittal of Patricio, uh, Giovanni, and Federico. Last man standing. That doesn't sound good. Oh, I did take damage. Oh, that sucks, dick. <laughs> I took damage, dude. Ah. Never mind. We do have medicine. But I'll try and get away with not using it for now. Right, where are we going? Ah. To the plaza. Oh. Oh, this doesn't look good. Are you fucking kidding me? You and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Yes, the documents that were delivered to you last night. I'm afraid I know nothing of these documents. You He's slimy lying. fuck. You need to get closer. In the absence of any compelling evidence to the contrary, I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced to death. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return. I swear we will! Father! Hey, grab the boy. He's one of them. I'll kill you for what you've done. Guards, arrest him. Ooh, you're a big dude. Oh, that's my sword gone. 
Yeah, good idea, strange hobo. Right, I'm running. Oh shit. Can you believe that I was, I was like, they fucking, they murdered my whole, well, not my whole family, but like, they killed little Petruchio as well? Like, how fucking horrible was that? I'm about to run into more enemies. Oh, you fucking serious? You blocked off that area, really? And now I've just run into more dudes, fuck. Need to get up high. But yeah, I mean, oh shit, I'm right on the edge of the map here. Oh, get in the, get in the, get in the stuff, get in the stuff, get in the stuff, yes! <laughs> you will be killing the last remaining male member of the Auditores. interest now well, there we go Whew, that is rough that is rough and I think we've just finished the sequence yes sequence one complete so that's really what starts this whole story Ezio's quest for revenge against the men who betrayed our family and we're gonna look fucking swish while we do it look at this oh the little cape love that <sighs> they will pay for that. That still gives me chills, that scene. Oh. I've got a little request for you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there, but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Anything for you, Sean? Yeah, that's not going to be a priority. <laughs> oh, hi. Sir Ezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I, I couldn't stop them, Annetta. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What if my mother and sister... They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No. It's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house. Just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, we are now, like, super wanted. Notorious. Now, there are ways of reducing your notoriety, but I don't think that's been unlocked yet. So we're gonna have to just avoid all the guards, which, as you've seen, is kind of difficult for me. <laughs> so, let's get up to the rooftops. There's usually less of them up there, unless... Oh, shit. No, no, no. No, that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. Let's let's not go to the rooftops right now. Reveal useful information. Yes, I know. I know about viewpoints. And that's the problem. Once you're entering areas of the map that we haven't unlocked, you don't really know where the enemies are going to be. Uh, I am going to get a slightly elevated position here. Another tapering crusader. I don't see any guards up here. Doesn't mean there aren't any, though. Coast looks clear. We have quite a ways to go, I think. Yeah, now, it's always been funny to me, right? The assassins are, you know, stealthy, blend in with the crowd. But you're wearing an outfit like that. You kind of stick out. You see anyone else wearing stuff like that? No. No. I mean, it looks cool as fuck. But I'm not sure it's too effective at, you know, <laughs> keeping you uh, low-key. Right. I know you can see the enemies sometimes, but I guess... Yeah. Still prefer to be able to see the map. Oh, shit, you guys are in the way. I think I. Oh god, who's seen me? Oh shit. Okay, they've lost me. Alright. Yeah, we're right on the edge of uh, 
the map here. Oh, fuck. Why are the guards everywhere, man? Is he gonna see me? They don't have that much range on the vision, but they still can spot you from a fair distance. Right, I just want him to turn around. I mean, if we have to fight him, we will, but I don't want to alert all of the guards in the area. Because that will be a pain in the tits. Oh shit. Fuck. But yes, you can you can hide, just like in the first game, you can hide on benches. You know, I'm just chilling here. I, I'm totally inconspicuous. There's a dude around here though. I think... Screw it, let's go this way. Oh yeah, they did kind of see me then, but luckily I was too fast. Ooh, that sun. Uh, ah, now these guys, these are thieves, which you can hire to help you distract enemies. Uh, can I hire them now or not? I'm not sure I can, actually. It's not giving me an option to. Yeah, may maybe I haven't unlocked that either. I don't know. They, I, There are certain groups of people like the thieves that really do come in handy on certain missions, though. Um, we'll, be, uh, we'll be seeing the courtesans soon enough. They, they definitely come in handy. Spe yeah, speaking of courtesans, we are about to enter the home of the courtesans. A very reputable establishment. A brothel. Fuckhouse. Um. There's one of the symbols. Oh. What does it mean? Ah, yes. It must be there for a reason. Can you take a closer look? Anything for you, Sean. Hey. Try using eagle vision. Give me fucking chance, Sean, okay? I You literally told me to do it, and then half a second later, you were like, fucking use eagle vision, you bitch. Yes, we have these glowing symbols. I think there's... Wait, wait, that's, that's 16 not of possible. them? This can't be. Hold on. That's computer code. Let me compile it. Oh, shit, it's an encrypted file. Ugh. Upload it to my computer. I'm a master at decryption. Hmm. Yeah, I can't. It's only compatible with the Animus itself. I'd upload it to Desmond then. I believe this. So these are one of the uh, hidden collectibles. Oh, this is. Uh, they, they call me Subject 16. Listen, I don't have much time. There's something I have to show you. We have been lied to this whole time. Everything we know, everything we've been brought up to believe, <laughs> it's wrong. Okay, um, I've uploaded the evidence, the file that, 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 that proves it all, but I've split it into 20 pieces and locked each with a code. <laughs> Can't be too careful. Qu Queen Isabella. No, not her. Uh, uh, ugh, what century is it? Uh, never mind. I've hidden the code to the first file inside this program. <sighs> Find it. Find them all. And along the way, you'll begin to see the truth. Some cre kind of creepy interference well, uh, going on. How did this get inside our animus? Oh. Oh, the memory core. We transferred 16's memory data from Abstergo into the Animus 2.0. He must have hacked the machine when Vidic left him alone between sessions. Oh, hold on, wait a second. The signs on the walls in Abstergo, the ones written in blood, those were clues. He was telling us to look for them inside the Animus. Okay, so that was a very long-winded way of saying there's like 20 of these glowing things on various places in the game. 
and you find him, and you unlock like a little smidgen of a clip, which apparently reveals the truth, which um, I, I will try and find all these, no promises though, they're kind of a pain in the ass, some of them, and then you've got like puzzles to do, and I suck at puzzles. But this is the first one, so it should be fairly easy. Five of these mythic scenes share a core similarity. Pick them out and you'll begin to see. Now, that's basically telling you. You need to find all pictures that have apples in them. And there's a lot of boobies going on as well. Um, so that's one. I mean, that's one. Some of them you can't quite see. You have to zoom in. Uh, no, don't see any there. Definitely see them there. Hope this doesn't get demonetized. Oh, I don't think it did when I first did it. I mean, it's only, it's only fucking artwork. Uh, oh, there's one. And then the last one. Oh, there we go. Boom. I kind of like these puzzles, though. Some, some of them are, are a little bit too cryptic for my small brain, but... I do, I do, um, I do quite enjoy that. They're a nice change of pace from, you know, stabbing people. And yes, we have the first, like, few milliseconds of this, um, this little video clip, so. So yeah, I mean, it's kind of cool that they expand on the lore of the Assassin's Creed universe. Some of it is quite interesting. But, again, I feel like the more games they made, the more they were just blatantly just making it up as they went along. Which, you know, can work, uh, but anyway. So, that's the first one of those found. I'll keep an eye out for them. I'm not going to go out of my way, though. Uh, right, okay. Anyway, let's get back to the story. Oh, oh, there's a viewpoint. Yeah, let's quickly grab this before we go in. Grab. Oh. Yeah, let's quickly grab this before we go and uh, rendezvous with our family. Tell them the bad news, if they don't already know. Ah, that fucking sucks, though. I try and put myself in Ezio's shoes and just try and imagine what that would be like to see that and be powerless to do anything about it. It'd be horrendous. Okay, and of course, why are there always guards right next to, like, the... Hey. Alright, anyway. We've made it, we've made it. A safe haven. For now. Hello. I think we have the wrong buildings. <laughs> yeah. No, this is it. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Messer Ezio. Annetta speaks quite highly of you. I can see why. I appreciate the kind words, Madonna. Ti prego, call me Paola. Thank you for offering your home to my family, Paola. It was the least I could do. You must be tired. Perhaps you'd... No, grazie. I can't stay. Why? Where are you going? To kill Uberto Alberti. I understand your desire for vengeance. But the Gonfaloniere is a powerful man. You are not a killer, Ezio. Spare me the lecture. But I can make you one. And why are you going to teach me how to kill? I'm not. I'm going to teach you how to survive. Come. You know, I have already murdered several people, to be fair. But yes, we are going to learn the way of the courtesans. Fitting in. Discretion is paramount in my profession. We must walk the streets freely. Seen, but unseen. You two must learn to blend like us, and become one with the city's crowds. My girls will show you how. Mm -hmm. So, enter a group to blend. Yeah, it, it is funny that you can blend in while dressed like that, but uh, benefit of the doubt. Like what you see? Yeah, you all look really, really similar. Follow Paola. Okay, will do. But we've got to remain hidden, because there are a bunch of fucking guards. 
very close by. Now, ah. I think in, in maybe Brotherhood, I don't know. In some of the games, you could just, he would walk automatically when you're blending. But I think you have to, unless there is a way of doing it, I don't know. I'm currently invisible. You know, as close as damn it anyway. Just gotta follow Paola. Luckily, these group of people are... A nice hat, by the way, buddy. These group of people are going exactly where I need them to go. Which is not always the case. Oh, shit. Am I... Yep, okay. Still good. We're still good. Now, I have messed this part up quite a few times. If you're a little bit unlucky with the crowd placement, which I sometimes am, like those guys, they're going that way. No, I don't... Shit. 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 Don't go that way, guys. I need you to... Ooh. Blend. 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 No, I, I just accidentally pickpocketed that dude. Fuck. And that one, too. Oh, I'm screwed. Ah, oh, Paolo, you're not making this easy for me. <laughs> I always fuck this up. And I didn't mean to accidentally pickpocket. Because we're going to learn to do that soon, anyway. Yes, I have to do this all again. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're just standing round. They're not showing me shit, alright? Look, they're just standing there. I am blending. Right, now we follow about. Right, let's try... Let's try this again. <laughs> Blend to become invisible to the guards. Yeah, I know. I need a crowd, though. I need some peeps. Can I blend with you guys? No, you need, like, I think at least three. No, that ain't working. There are no crowds see of me to blend with. The only ones that there are are currently walking in the opposite direction. There are no crowds. I'm about to get spotted. I can blend on this bench, but I'm not going to get anywhere, am I, on this bench? Look, reduce distance to the target. I'm about to fail this again. Oh. Oh. Just in time. All right, you guys fuck off. Are there any groups of people? Oh, yeah. There we go. All right. Okay. We might be all right. I am one of the crowd. I am just a regular Joe Bloggs. Don't mind me. Right, are they gonna go? They're going that way. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, you're going the wrong way, guys. Oh. That was close. Any crowds coming this way? You guards piss off. You didn't see shit. There's guards right there. There's no... Quick, quick, quick. Oh. I need some crowds to come by. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Paolo, don't go too far. Don't go too far. You're going too far, Paolo. Paolo. Pa Paolo. Whatever the fuck your name is. All right. Yeah, to be honest, this is like one of my least favorite missions. It's so dull and so frustrating. <laughs> We've nearly done it. Please go the right way, crowd. Please go the right way. I think they are. Yes. It's much easier to blend when you can hire groups of people that will stick to you. Like the courtesans and the thieves, but... When you have to rely on the randomness of the crowds, it kind of sucks. Did you just fucking sneeze on me, dirty bastard. That's how the plague spreads. Alright, we're nearly done. Are we nearly done? He's leading us on a merry chase. A 
don't think there's any more guards, though. So I think we're good. Yeah, we're, we're back. We're back, baby. We did it. Bene. Now that you've learned to blend, I'll show you how to use it for more than just moving around. Let's teach you how to steal. Yeah, I've already done that. <laughs> I've already done that by accident. But, um, can I steal from your courtesans? Oh, I can. Once Hurry away after stealing to avoid. Ezio, you mustn't linger. Yeah, I know. Oh, I can't go back that way? Shit. I'll take your money. Take your money. And yours. There we go. Oh, four out of five. Shit. And yours. Wait, we did it. Shit, I'm about to be Really? Really, game? You fucking... Oh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I wanted to sit on the bench and I ended up like kicking the person that was on it. Fuck. Right, let's escape. Can't believe they got me spotted straight out of a cutscene. That sucks. Yeah, I'm on the roof, guys. Fuck you. Which way did he go? Which way did he go? Alright, blend on the bench. Sit on the bench. There we go. They'll never know. They're right above me. He's right. Th How do you not... <laughs> How do you not see me? What? He did? Are you fucking kidding? Oh, I don't have a sword. I don't have a sword anymore. Time to run, Ezio. Time to run. I don't believe that. I was taking the piss out of the game for, like, having no awareness and then suddenly... He looked at me too long. He looked at me too long. I need to get out of here. Whee! Oh, fuck. Should have grabbed it. I thought he was going to land on it. Oh, they lost me. They lost me. Okay. Right. Oh. I'm back. You can go now, girls. Oh, do we have to? So innocent. He's cute. Now that you have learned how to approach the enemy, we need to find you a suitable weapon. Yes. What would you have me use? Ah, but you already have the answer. Hey, my father's blade and bracer. How did you get them? <laughs> By using the same skills I've just taught you. It's not exactly in working condition. I assume you're familiar with Leonardo da Vinci. Yes. But how does a painter factor into this? He's far more than that. Bring him the pieces. You'll see. Oh, we will. Before I go, one last question, if I may. Of course. Why have you given your aid so readily to me, a stranger? I too know betrayal. Ooh, fuck. Now that's a story. I'm sure you have. Uh, ace up my sleeve. Visit Leonardo da Vinci in his workshop to see if he can repair Giovanni's blade. We will be doing that. Because we want our hidden blade. Oh, the hidden blade is one of the coolest weapons ever devised in any video game ever. Uh, but we are going to do that next time, guys. Thank you very much for watching this second session of Assassin's Creed 2. Again, I'm going to apologize uh, if if I talk a lot of shit. Although, I'm sure a lot of you are used to that by now, hopefully. But I'm loving this game. Uh, that last mission does kind of suck, though. I'm glad we got it out of the way. Um, so, soon we're going to be kind of let loose. Once we get our hidden blade, we're going to be much more capable of actually assassinating people. And... Uh, and yeah, Ezio is raring to go. So, we're going to go see Leonardo next time. Thank you for watching, everyone. And I uh, hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now. This is Snake, telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.